All right, guys. Uh, home alone. And you know what? It needs to be cleaned up in here. Um, I got things a little bit messy up in here. And you know what? I just, I feel like I can't, I can't be motivated. I can't be positive. I can't move forward unless things are cleaned up. Um, so I'm just doing a quick little walkthrough and to show you what it looks like right now before I come through, before the nerd train comes rolling through and uh, gets everything cleaned up. Um, so guys, that's the before picture. And uh, let's look outside. Yeah, it's still coated in snow before it's probably still going to be coated afterwards but uh that's the before picture guys let's see if i can make a difference up in this biatch but before i do anything guys i need some motivation i need some bulletproof coffee i need some coffee asmr there's something wonderful about making coffee and the sounds and smells that you encounter while you're doing it. Let me open up this bag and have a sniff. Sniff those beans. Just sniff them, guys. I'm going to I'm going to ground up these uh, Starbucks espresso beans and make the most delightful batch of coffee ever. Oh, we're getting low. We're getting low on coffee beans. I'm going to have to, you know, do that thing. Get to the store where people are going cray-cray. All right. It all begins with the little grinding action. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm getting excited already. We got the ground coffee beans. I got a pre-rinsed filter. I think it's important to rinse that filter. I'm going to get that grounded coffee up in there so that I can get that coffee up in me. You know, you know it's all good in the hood. All right, so let's get this thing started, right? Let's get this coffee a brewing, and let's see if we can get us some ASMR coffee action. Nerds and nerdettes, I bring to you Technivore Mocha Master. Let's get this ASMR kicked off right so guys pop your peepers sniff your sniffers and let's have a look and let's open our ears to the sounds of coffee Oh, yeah. Never thought percolating would sound so beautiful. But just listen to the sound of that percolation action. And look at it. And what I want you to do right now is I want to breathe deeply together. You and me. Let's breathe deeply as this coffee begins to enter our nostrils. Open your nostril holes and inhale the smell. Open your ear holes and listen to the sound of percolating.
Ulala. Mm -mm -mm. I took the lid off so we could get really close to the, the water. Looks like something's happening down there. Oh, you guys. Let's get up in this coffee machine. Let's see what's actually going on underneath. Oh, look at it. Are you guys looking at it? Look at that as it happens. You can almost feel the caffeine in your body. Hot, drippy water dripping down on the top of some grounded up Starbucks coffee beans. Oh man. This coffee ritual is so fantastic and so beautiful. You might just have a nerdgasm, y'all. Don't forget to smash that like button. And if you're enjoying this coffee ASMR, smash that like button and drop a one in the chat. Drop a one in the chat if you can feel it, if you can smell it, if you can almost taste me and my coffee. Oh, we're getting there, guys. We're getting there. Almost time to make it. All right. Night, night, coffee. See you in the morning in my stomach. Continuing on with the coffee ASMR, let's drop some no sugar tablets up into the cup. Four should do the trick. All right, all right, let's set that to the side and let's get some cream action, guys. You can almost feel the creaminess. By the way, for those that don't know, that says coffee cream. So I like to put some of this up in a cup yeah, cream in a cup. I said it. I said it. And then I like to take a whisk and just whisk it away. Look at that. Look how big it got, guys. Look how big it got. So creamy. Oh, yeah. Now I'm going to I'm going to pour that up in. Listen closely. Oh, 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 and you know what? Let's do a little something, something today. I want all that cream in me. I want all of it in me. So I am going to pour some coffee up into that cup.
and dump it in. Oh, I spilled a little bit. It's all good. It is all good. Now, ladies and gentlemen, for the final whisking action. And that, nerds and nerdettes, is a fine-ass cup of coffee. Let's take a sip. Mm-mm-mm. Time to get her done. Coffee ASMR. All right, guys. Let's take that to her one more time. Yeah, I got her done. I cleaned it up. I got everything in order. Slash... He helped. What, bro? Yeah, Slash helped. We're in here getting nerdy, cleaning everything up, making it all nice for Nerdette. Okay, well, there's a little uh, cluttered area, but we'll we'll sort that out later. But uh, yeah, we are good to go. Got everything fixed. Got it all cleaned up. Everything is smelling good, looking good, and we got the candles lit. Slash, Slash is a happy camper, and uh, yeah, I got her done, guys, and the icing on the cake, Mr. Pie, he gets some tasty shreds, here you go, sir, tasty shreds delivered, bone appetizzle, bone appetizzle, my kizzle. All right, guys, check it out. I'm going to be making this pulled chicken stuff, slow-cooked pulled chicken. All you got to do is heat it up. So I'm going to be um, cooking it in the oven. And one of the keys to this stuff I've learned is to just smash it up nice in the bag first. Yeah, this is actually a satisfying feeling, too. Um, I love just squishing this thing up. It feels so good. Ooh la la, squish it up in my finger holes. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Um, so, you can squish it up. And next comes the fun part, guys. Squirting it out into the pan. Um, get ready for this. This, this is also very satisfying. Um... I don't know if Ashley ankylizing spondylitis is around, but if you see this, this is for you. Ooh. Ooh, doesn't that look delish? <laughs> it actually doesn't look very good at all. But uh, something about squeezing it out of the bag. You know, some people like enjoy pimple popping. I don't enjoy that, but I do enjoy squeezing chicken out of a bag. Um, but that's just me. And um, I want to get every bit out because this stuff is actually bomb. So there it is, guys. I'm going to smash it into the pan and put it in the oven for a half hour. I'm thinking about making some, some pancakes to go with it. I don't know. What do you think? Pancakes? Yeah, pancakes. All right, guys, so here's what's going to go in these coconut flour pancakes. Um, two tablespoons of coconut flour. Two eggs. There they go. Two eggs rolling away. Um, a little bit of sweetener. A little bit of vanilla. And a little bit of baking soda. That's it. And I'm going to cook them in coconut oil. And uh, these should be low carb and super yummy and perfect with uh, that pulled chicken so let's see how this turns out and there you have it guys coconut flour low carb keto pancakes um, I forgot one ingredient and that was two tablespoons of butter but uh, looks like they turned out looks like they're edible some of them got a little dark but uh, you know I think they're gonna be just fine so uh, yeah bone appetizzle and there you have it, guys. Pulled chicken, coconut flour pancakes, 
and garlic dressing. This is uh, getting really creative here. Uh, you, you'd think I was huh, I was stoned or something when I created this, but no. I just uh, getting creative and uh, unique. So hope this is good. I'm about to find out. Time to dig in. Oh yeah, it is bath time. Oh yeah, look at him get into it, guys. That is one sexy cat beast taking a bath right in the middle of the living room. Oh yeah, get it, slap. Oh, don't mind me, sir. Continue on with your little bath. Oh, all right. You got an itch. All right, guys. That wraps up another keto vlog. Um, another day in the books. Day 76. No, 77. Uh, going on three months of this keto vlog. So, uh, I, 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 I've done some, uh, behind the scenes weigh-ins without the weigh-in inspector and I'll just say guys it's moving downwards again so uh, we'll just have to see it's a couple days away from the the actual weigh-in uh, report so we'll see how it goes either way guys thank you guys for coming smash that like button like a hulk tell your friends about the vlog and uh, I will see you all again tomorrow peace